What is going on guys? It's Fun Fan 97 and I'll be showing you guys how to save a project that you've been working on and how to use it over and over again without actually overwriting the file. And it's really, really simple to do. All you gotta do is first open a project. I haven't opened one, so I'm gonna do that right now. So I'm going to pictures and then I'm gonna go ahead and select a picture to open in Photoshop. Um, so give it a moment. Um, you know, this works with any project as long as it's a Photoshop document. It should work. Uh, it's a .psd. Just if you're wondering, it is a .psd. So you want to save that first. So okay, here it's loaded. Let's go into this is what I save into my PSD templates. So I'm gonna go ahead and select. Um, let's go ahead and select. I don't know MacBook. Say this one that I've created. Uh, and I don't know why I created this. I, I just got bored and just messed around to you know. Anyway, so um, if you want to save it and just say you wanted to add some text. Um, say you wanted to say, or type, I don't know, um, tutorial, um, video, and you don't want to, you know, you just move it around and you don't want to overwrite the file. So if you were to go to file and click save, what that does, it basically overwrites the file and it saves everything with what you've done to it. And if you click save as, this will not um, overwrite it, but you got to do some stuff because if you, if you just click save, it's just going to overwrite it again. So what you do is you leave it, you know, give it a name, always select a different place um, unless it's, this is going to be a thumbnail, of course. Um, I mean, if you're going to save it as a thumbnail, so this is going to be a thumbnail. It can be anything else as long as you don't have, if you, as long as you don't have it um, to overwrite it, like, um, anyway, so let's go to format. Let's go ahead and select JPEG. Um, that's always used for uh, thumbnails or whatever you're going to be using. Just select the format. Um, this is where you want to change. You want to change the directory or the destination to desktop or somewhere else. So save it to desktop and save as, give it a name, and click save. Just make sure it's not in the same directory or else that will overwrite it. And um, that's basically it. So um, you can save it as a PSD too, and that will just save the same document without overwriting the old one. So if that helps in any way, then go ahead and leave a like in the comment section, in the like, in the description. Um, I always said that last time, in the description. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. But before I leave, before you leave, and I leave, um, comment in the description what you guys want to see. Um, you know, Photoshop tutorials, if it's Minecraft tutorials, just tell me. I'll uh, try to make videos for that. Um, just be aware that I won't make a video on Thanksgiving because, you know, it's Thanksgiving and same with Friday. Maybe Friday, I highly doubt it. Um, and yeah, so I'm probably going to make a video on Wednesday, hopefully. Uh, fingers crossed. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.